Hi, I'm Project PowerPoint, but I'm also bored. And like many of you, I just am tired of all this lockdown business. But I mean, that's natural. If you're doing nothing, if you're not allowed to leave your homes only for exercise, then it's very likely that you're going to get bored. So I thought to pass the time, first of all, I'm going to exercise, and then I'm going to set myself a bit of a challenge. So at the moment, it's 10 past 7. And in one hour, I'm going to challenge myself, a one hour challenge, to create the most advanced PowerPoint operating system I can. Now, this is going to be very... S mm, I'm not, I've never done this before. I've never practiced for this before. So I'm going to probably have it as a time lapse with a few status updates in the middle. Um, so without further ado, let's get started. I'm just going to give myself hardly any resources see what I can come up with. Well, so this didn't come as uh, advanced as I expected it to be, but an hour is actually, I've discovered, not that much of time really. So I've created a very basic operating system with one application, but it's got a few cool features, so let's go through it. So I hit F5 and it gives this really cringy logo, Project PowerPoint, there we go. I did warp the P so it looks very weird. And then we <laughs> locked down, alright. Yeah, I call it locked down because... I can't think of anything <laughs> more <laughs> inventive. Right, enter a username. So uh, I can call this, I don't know, we're stuck at home. Very relevant. And enter a password. Oh dear. And account is set up. There we go. Now there's a time that doesn't actually update because <laughs> I didn't have enough time to do that. And then we're stuck at home. You can choose from all these accounts, but uh, should I do stuck? Yeah, I'll just sign in with we're stuck at home. So if you get it wrong, blah, 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 then incorrect password. If you get it right, oh dear. Well, not oh dear that you got it right, but oh dear is a password. And then it gives you the minimalist desktop. And then if we open the start menu, which you have to click very precisely, otherwise it doesn't work you have one application which is notepad and then you can save files so you could say uh, uh, go away COVID-19 <laughs> file you can save that so I'm going to call that uh, message to the cosmos I can't spell that there you go and save so now that is saved, you can open any file you want by double clicking it will update it. Uh, so <laughs> it's one I made earlier, oop, OSAR, and you can open another one, 
message to the cos cosmos go away COVID-19 now you can't update the file that you created because I, I didn't have enough time to do that but you can open and save files which I guess is cool oh wow mm. that's annoying so if you click this it sends you some oh I did yeah so I was gonna say it was very polished for the amount of time I had but I now revoke that well there you go that's all or oh, there's also sign out but I mean that's not that's not a separate ma separate macro it's just a macro that lists the account here I can't speak so um, for first try I thought that was pretty good it also one of the plus sides is it gives me a good idea of how much work and gets done in an hour and well there you go and I challenge you people to go and make um, a PowerPoint OS in an hour and I'll see your responses if you bother to so thank you for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one bye